That's what I look like. What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs? Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a bad feeling about this. There are quite a lot of rooms. This is Pi Conrad. Within Masters. sense of it. This is how he lived. Oh, the bottle of liquor. Well, guess you can blame him for drinking in this situation. Can we? Okay, we can go in there. Okay, go in there. Maybe they wanted to keep close to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. Maybe. You're really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. Hey, that's my room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Tested the machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way. Like someone had specifically created it for WoW to see on. When activated, the machine mimicked the room and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as a simulation in said digital space. The presentation shot read and was quickly terminated. Terminated. Oh, pronunciation reasons. It scares me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. Catherine. Maybe you too are just stone. Have you thought about it? After dissecting the vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear that the WoW copied my capsule project to reconstruct the scene to hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar in its construction except for one point. Where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs, the vivarium's brain scan lives on. It isn't limited by its content from the originating brain scan read emerged. The read inside the vivarium was a perfect copy. I have it. I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos too. I can't figure out figure out how it worked with the vivarium, but I can replicate WoW scanning technique using the pilot seats. They are already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. So I'm still a flat copy, right? But 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 how are the others then? It was even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to allow the diffraction and high energy needed to capture a scan. I suspect WoW has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the mockingbirds. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and used it as basis for intelligence and machines. Wow, that's creepy. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we have now officially started the ARC project. We are to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule. Then we will launch it into space using the space gun. It's nice to think something will live on like that. 
Mark Serang killed himself after his skin. He has been suggesting everyone should kill themselves as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the Ark. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff and apparently it's my fault somehow. Stromlyer's not happy with me. Hope it will calm down. The capsule. Richard gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before. Unfolded one of them to make a new friend for Capsule Catherine and her gang of legacies. New way to simulate turbulence makes the weather system so much better. Implemented Reed. Didn't go well. You try with Reed. Reed won't play nicely with the others. She's too real. So I'm talking with Capsule Catherine and her King of Legacies. What? Am I that new friend that wasn't photos for Capsule Catherine? What? Am I? Catherine, do you have anything to say to that? What's with the junk? Looks like something you'd fish out of the ocean. Huh? Oh, you mean... Yeah, that's a part of Reed's vivarium. It's... It, it, it's a long story. Forget it. I would love to hear it. Dear friends, when you read this, I would have entered the ark. As I've explained, this is accomplished by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. Do not frighten, Catherine. I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum and placing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear the announced completion, I will bite down quickly, closing my own demise. When you discover the truth behind my death, no, there's no tragedy to mourn, for I am victorious. I advise you all to do the same and join me inside the ark. Well, it probably went horribly wrong, dear Mark. Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? They typically don't stay with us till we die. Some live a few days, while others live a few years. We're not affected by their short lifespans, as they're replaced by new cells which help sustain our bodies. I don't think anyone would argue that we ever lose our persona due to this process. Yet we are clearly in a constant state of transformation. <laughs> then how do we remain the same? A continuous flow of thought and perception keeps an unbroken chain of continuity that we know as our self. Our conscious mind is not the pattern of our brain, but a continuous emergent entity based on that pattern. When Dr. Chun populates the Ark, she is capturing a moment of our existence and placing it inside the digital world. Soon you and your digital you will grow apart due to 
diverging experiences, but for a tiny window, you are the very same. With unbroken continuity, it will live on. A fulfilling life, no doubt, no less real than the one from which it was plucked. Now remember, you are not your body. You are the emergent entity. That entity just happens to occupy two places at once for a while. If you took away your body, you would simply be the only one you can be. The you inside the Ark. Let your body die and continue on in the digital paradise among the stars. Dude, that went horribly wrong. I don't know what this is supposed to do. Mr. Serang, the company is very pleased to hear of your success in making the wild station wide presence. We trust you, appreciate what a unique opportunity this is, and that you will do everything in your power to fully explore and understand this mystery. To do so, you need to ensure that Dr. Joel Ross is able to steer and study the world from Alpha without outside interference. In case of an emergency, you may direct, direct Julia Dahl at Omicron to forcefully eliminate any opposition, but please make an effort to avoid extreme actions. The WoW is an important, costly affair, and we hope to follow a steady development with outside effects. So, you actually wanted the WoW to be in place? I don't quite get it. Is this the Ark? Oh, okay, I went back. I was I was worried for a second that there was somebody else, but I went back. Oh, Robin. Yeah, come on, make me feel guilty that I killed you. Herself with the razor. Apparently, she was successful doing so. So that was you. No, you aren't anymore. Disgusting. Don't touch it. What the hell are you doing? I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. Helps me focus. That's. I, I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. So what? I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. <sighs> Let's just keep going.
This doesn't sound good at all. in here. 